Forty Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl eighty nine. Today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Gleitnir chapter fifty eight. So last chapter we saw um, Elena and uh, Shuichi put the suit to use, and um, they decided uh, to go to Kaido's, and they fought their uh, fought minions that you know fused. And this was Takeda. This was some foreshadowing of what what's um, what we're about to see here because. Um, we saw one of the minions, like, totally eat this person, um, or this monster whole and completely absorb her, and I got a feeling that's, we're gonna be seeing something very similar here. <laughs> it really feels like it, um, especially with how, um, they were stabbed because something's going, definitely going on in the, in the suit. It is, because remember what the coins... Are, um, are supposed to represent in terms of alien lives. Just saying. Anyway, I can't wait to see how it's going to be reflected in the design of, uh, of this form. So without further ado, let's get to this. Oh my god. You know what? This chapter is titled uh, The Way to End a Story. And <laughs> I fucking love this, Takeda. I love this. Because I know... A lot of people, because art is subjective, a lot of people will be like, this is a blob. Dude, <laughs> I'm sorry, you're an uncultured swine if you think this. Because what this is, is actually a mass of energy. That's what this is. This is just pure energy. And if you can't see it, then I'm sorry, you need to have your eyes reevaluated. I know art is subjective, but god damn it, how can you not see this is a mass of energy? This is pure energy. What does this mean? Obviously, he's uncultured as fuck because he don't see that this is pure energy. What is happening? See, look at that close-up of the arm. That proves my point that this is pure energy right there. See, I got it, Takeda. <laughs> yes! See? I got it as soon as he touched him. Bam! I told you. This was pure fucking energy. But then, what does that mean for especially Elena? Oh, God. Hopefully we're going to get an explanation about, um, well, not just Shuichi, obviously. But for Elena, too. Like, jeez. This could be very interesting. I wonder what is more in this world. Um, oh, wait, what? Yeah, what is more in this world, happiness or sadness? What do you think, Shuichi? Ooh! Ooh! Shuichi absorbed Elena! Look at this! Shuichi absorbed... Elena is... So Elena's dead? Okay, I gotta read that sentence again, because it got... Because whoever translated this fucked up the grammar. I wonder what there is more... Uh, what... There, uh, what is, oh my god, maybe I did read the, maybe the grammar is right, and I'm just really fucked up right now. Oh my god. No, okay, I gotta read it the way that I'm picturing it in my head. I wonder, um, uh, what there is more of in this world, uh, happiness or sadness? What do you think, Shuichi? I fucking love this art! The key of this art is just beautiful oh my god look at this gorgeousness i'm gonna cry we are really in a manga renaissance we are in a golden age of manga and i am going to do a video on this next month it's just it just pisses me off that we will not see this greatness adapted in anime i'm just i'm sorry unless takeda is there overseeing this or like well, uh, I, I really hate that. I really hate the uh, state of the anime industry right now. I really do. I fucking hate it. I'm and it, oh god, if you are not reading Hitman by Sia Koji, you do not know what's going on. It's awful. I really hate it. Hate it. Get him. Get him, uh, Shuichi. Yeah, look at this shit. This art. This art! I see, Shuichi. So that's your power. Kaidoka 
everyone, I've come to stop you too. This is breathtaking. I'm sorry, I have to say it, Takeda. And I have to also ask this. Were you inspired by um, Akamasu Sensei? Because this looks like a lot like Tona. This is so much like Tona in UQ Holder. It really is. This is like his lightning form when he went to go save um when uh he went to go save Kurovaru. You cannot deny if you're a UQ Holder reader, you cannot deny this. You know this is true that this looks a lot like Tona's form. This totally does. Yes, the hair is completely different, but like, uh, I'm sorry. The vibes from what what I'm what I mean is, I know the form itself looks different. Yes, I know. But the thing is, is the um the concept itself is very very similar to Tota. It really is because Tota it was the same thing where it was energy, it was pure energy. And how he, like, tra oh, how, how Tota transformed into it was just so fucking cool, too. Oh, gosh. But, yeah. It, and yes, it was a little bit different. But still, it was pure energy. And, God, this for I'm sorry. It's just making me think of Tota from UQ Holder. I cannot. I cannot, Takeda. Oh, God. You have become strong, Shuichi. Try to stop me. But if you can't stop me, I will erase this world. Woo! Yes, dude! I'm sorry! This is just... I can't! I can't! This just is really making me think of you kill Holder! Oh, God! Kaido, you you try to be Nikita... Nah, I can't say he's trying to be like Nikitas, because Nikitas is way hotter, and Nikitas is just, is just cooler. <laughs> Nikitas is an asshole, but Nikitas is better. And Nikitas don't have a five head like, uh, like, like Kaido does. <laughs> Let's be real! Dude, this is so beautiful. Kaido Kun, why? Why did you change? This is the transformation of um, Elena and me. I swear to God. This is beautiful. So, this right here is gonna, this is something to think about. Are we gonna get something similar? With, uh, with Claire and, um, Shuichi. I don't know. I'm gonna continue the, I'll, I'll I'm gonna think about this while I've continued the, to cover this, because I'm gonna finish, this is just getting awesome. It's surpassing Kaido Kun, whoa, and this is just with the, li and I want you guys to remember this. Remember, Elena has only half a coin. She used only half a coin. So, th so this is one coin right here that um, that my boy uh, Shuichi is using. And God, this uh, this is just freaking killing me. Why? Why did you not go to? M you know what? This is just another one of those series where I really wish IG Productions would have adapted this one. I really do. Either IG or Shaft should have adapted Gleipnir in terms of art and animation. I really, really wish it would have been IG or Shaft. I'm sorry. I have to say it. Wish, I wish it was IG or Shaft. Because the thing is, is with, um, with this manga, and I know people were saying that the art w was good. I'm sorry. I don't agree with it because... I, from what I saw, it just, it just did not capture the avant-gardeness and the abstractness that Takeda has in the art. And the only studios that I know, well, yeah, David Productions could do it too, but I, and I know you could give me the argument that Bones can do it as well, but I just know, well, I know I'm going to keep throwing IG Production out there. Uh, because I know the VP personally, so, and I bet she's such a nice lady. I love Maki. I just know that Maki would give this manga ch the justice it deserves. If you've seen Fully Cooly, um, you know that, that IG Productions could just, like, really pull this off. 
Oh god, IG Productions would give this manga the adaptation it deserves. And also, if you've seen anything that Shaft does, you know that Shaft could just Shaft just does like the bizarre and abstract art just beautifully. Oh, it just kills me that it ugh, kills me that we won't get it. it. Pisses me off. Like really oh god, Maki, please, please for the love of God, just please readapt this manga. please if you get, Maki, get the rights to this manga so you can adapt it! As, if you could get season two, Maki, please do it. That would be awesome. But God, this is just so beautiful. You know, I've never changed. Hmm? I have always chosen the path I considered right. Um, no matter what the outcome would, uh, would be. Even if uh, that path is far from the human path, I will not allow myself to be stopped. Since this is the- Ooh! Ha! <laughs> Takea! Since this is the story I started! Oh! Ooh! Yes! Yeah, Takeda! Yes! Have I used too much power? I don't have time to regenerate myself. Stop! Do this close-up, the intensity in Shuichi's eyes. Takeda, this art is just so powerful. And I gotta say, I, something that I really love about this manga, and this and it's not just limited to this manga. I'm, I, again, this is why I say we're in the golden age of manga and the manga renaissance, is that... Takeda, as well as a lot of the other mangaka that I've noticed, is they're really pushing themselves. I don't know what started it, if it's what Murata did a while back in One Punch Man manga. I, I don't I don't know if it's the increased competition. I don't know. But I really, really like this. I like that the mangaka are pushing themselves. I don't know what's inspiring them, but I am one billion percent okay with this this art is just so beautiful i'm just it's just something that i don't think any of us have ever seen in our lifetimes i really don't think so fuck even I, like and and i've been reading like mong retro manga as well um since, you know, the Corona Sama started, I was, and even a little bit before that, I was reading retro manga. Like, I, I was, obviously, to cover Captain Tsubasa, um, uh, I read Captain Tsubasa, all of Captain Tsubasa. I've been reading, I read since, uh, Saint Seiya and all that. And even in eight, comparing it, this to, like, 80s manga and 50s and 60s manga, I've never seen anything like what we're getting right now it is just incredible this art is just so beautiful hanoka-san you can do it right i i killed hanoka because uh, of an idea of mine and i revived her to run away uh, of that sin i committed you're saying i must kill hanoka again despite that Ooh. If you kill me, you will stop Hanoka. Make up your mind, Shuichi. That that way you'll end um end up my story. Oh! Now that is a very interesting twist and an interesting thought. Because this is something that a lot that a lot of people aren't realizing within themselves. Is that if you want to stop something, if you, like, really want to stop something, especially like this. I'm, I'm, go I'm going to read this again. If you kill me, you will stop Hinoka. Make up your mind, Shuichi. That way you'll, uh, um, oh, it says that way you'll end up my story. And it says, um, it's, it's okay, do it. You'll regret it if you don't do it now. No! I think, I think it's supposed to be, I think it's supposed to be you'll end, that way you'll end my story instead of end up my story. I was thinking it differently. I was like, wait a minute, what? Didn't make sense. 
these translators need to fix this because I was having a completely different thought. I was just like, wait, what? If it's you'll end up my story, then it's just like, wait. If it's that way, then what um, Kaido is saying, you'll end up like me. You'll end up becoming the person you hated. And if that's the case, that's an even bigger twist. It really is. And it's something that I've been seeing where, you know, people are becoming the things that they hated um, as time goes on. They don't, And they don't even realize it. It's freaking hilarious, actually. And ironic as fuck. But anyway. You must not kill this person. This person must suffer. This person must suffer more. Ooh. Now you understand, don't you? I'm telling you, to the person that is looking at me from there. Oh, she saw him! I will not allow you to get in my way. There stands the goddess of war in her arms, my sad friend. So, Hanoka saw Shuichi! Oh my god, that was meta as hell. So, this is really very interesting. That's an interesting thought, too. That Hinoka has brought up. Hinoka could kill Kaido at any time. And this chapter has brought this up. That Kaido, that Shuichi could kill, could have killed Kaido at any time. And Hinoka could kill Kaido at any time. But Kaido, Hinoka is allowing Kaido to live. She's the one that is running this bitch. It ain't Kaido running this bitch. It's Hanoka running this bitch. Hanoka is the one running the show. Because she wants him to suffer. For what he did. This is his punishment. And I understand what Kaido's saying now. It's, he's saying that if um, Shuichi kills, if Shuichi does not kill Hanoka, Hanoka and not, uh, if she, hold on, let me go back here real quick. It says, if you kill me, you will stop Hinoka. I don't, here's the thing. I don't know if that's necessarily true now. Wait, hold on. It is true. Oh, okay. Let me, re let me rephrase that. Rephrase this. Let me reread this again. You're saying I must kill Hinoka again despite that? Um, if you uh, kill me, you will stop Hinoka. So, we're going to have to fight Hinoka. We will. But in order to do that, but, but you have to kill, sh sh but in order to kill Hinoka, you gotta kill Kaido. This is gonna be very, very interesting. This could be very interesting. This is very, very complicated. Hold, let me read this again. Holy shit. Um, I killed Tanoka because of an idea of mine, and I revived her to run away of that sin I committed. You're saying I must kill Hanoka again despite that? If you kill me, you will stop Hanoka. Make up your mind, Shuichi. That way you'll end up my sto um, That way you'll um, end up my story. Do it. You'll regret it if you don't do it now. So yeah. Oh, so... Yeah, we gotta kill Kaido to stop... Okay, so we gotta kill Kaido to stop Hinoka. That's the main thing we gotta do. We gotta kill Kaido or Hinoka's gonna keep rampaging. This is going to be very, very hard. It is, because Hinoka wants to keep uh, Kaido alive for him to suffer for what he did to her. Oh man, this is going to be very interesting. Ooh, this is going to be interesting. Now, in regards to Claire, though, 
Because Claire has a full coin. Hmm. Do I think that um, if she uses that full coin and becomes fused with, uh, um, truly fused with uh, um, Shuichi, is it going to make a huge difference? I think they would be able to kill Kaido a lot faster, sure. Um, that's going to be, because, I, actually, I don't even know if that's going to be enough to kill Kaido. Well, the, you know what? Yeah, they're gonna have they're gonna have to do that so they could kill Kaido. And I think they can. I think if they if um she does if Claire does this and they tr and they fully fuse like um like Elena and uh, Shuichi did, yes, they'll be able to do it. It's gonna be really it's gonna be harder because Kaido's a lot stronger. And then you got you got the Hinoka uh, factor as well. But the key thing is is Shuichi cannot hesitate. If Shuichi hesitates, then they are fucked. And I understand now why, um, why Kaido kept Hinoka away now from uh, Shuichi, because he did not want Hinoka to remember um, Shuichi. Because if she did, then she would start torturing Kaido again. <laughs> I get it now. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more um, Gleep Nair content, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something on my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, find me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.